on the train from Portland, Oregon. Boarding, boarding, boarding. Second door on the right, room 15. Closet. There is a closet. This is it. Close the door, please. Close the door. Yeah. No? No, we have to work around it. What's in there? It's this, this, it's this. Oh, it's, it's narrow. narrow. What is it? Is this supposed to store? Temperature floor? control. Wow. And then there's this. You have to be oh, very yeah. short. Oh my gosh. And it's not the the WC. Oh look, here's a bed. Is this a bed? Yeah. Wow, it's a tiny bed. How does this work? Huh. Okay. Here we go, leaving Portland in our family room. Got two short beds and two longer beds. This is the top of one of them here. I think we can leave that one down. It looks like it's about, what's that, four feet? Yeah, about four feet. If you curl up, it works too. Here we go. It's a table. Whoa. Does it not lock? Oh, it's just here now. Do oh, not board. Oh. Do they have checkers? Our menus fell in the Oh boy. What fell in? Our menus fell in the tree here. Oh it came back out the other side. Doo doo. Thirty one hours. Thirty six hours. Uh it's from Seattle. Water. And lunch is ready. So we're going to see this for 31 hours. Ha ha ha, not really. We were originally planned. We were originally planned to be in two different rooms, but they put us in a family room. The information for you is going to start right off with the most important item on this train. That is your mask. You're going to hear us say this more than a few times today. It is something we have to go over. It is a federal mandate that you must wear your mask covering your nose and your mouth at all times unless you're actively eating or drinking. Once again, that face mask will cover your nose and your mouth at the same time. If we do see your mask below your nose, we will politely ask you to scooch it up to cover it. It is a very simple request and it is a federal mandate. 
and you will not get a refund. It is a $500 fine these days. Yes, it did go up. So, obviously, we do not want to have to remove you from the train, and we don't want that to happen to you, but we will do it if you do not comply with our mask guidelines. We'll Wear you your mask. Stops. That'll be you, Gene, and Climate Falls. Otherwise, there'll be no smoking on board this train anywhere. If you do smoke outside, we will come yeah. find you because it's easy for us to do so with the tail of smoke. <laughs> we will talk to you. We'll take turns. About you smoking the lavatories or anywhere else that you do. And we'll stop the train, let you smoke outside, and you'll see us pulling away. We will wave and wish you good luck. Also, the farther south we go, the more people do want to drink. So, we drink responsibly if you're of age. We do not tolerate intoxication on board this train. As mentioned before, we are federal, so any abuse, verbal or physical, against any employee on this train will result in removal, arrest, and fine of the passenger who does that. I just realized. Enough of the scary stuff. Too. Oh, it, if you do need any questions answered, it's in there. The employee will try and help you. To the best of our abilities, if we cannot help you, we will find someone or call someone who may hopefully know the answer. Shoes will be required at all times when you do walk about the train, that's for your safety. Please supervise your children if you do have any. That includes to the restroom, to another car in the train, and all of that stuff. Put this one down or leave it up for now? I'll leave it up for now. Currently, it's gonna look yeah, for like five minutes late. We want to Not too shabby. If we do become late, we'll let you know in the meantime. Let's get back relaxed. Let's see it. Up high, I think. Oh, yeah. Oh, there we go.